Hello everybody, this is Casey Berger, and welcome to the first episode of The Burger Joint. A series of videos that I'm going to make just discussing whatever I really want to, whether it be scripted or not. Take a wild gander at which one this is. Anyways, over the recent days, the new Sonic Frontiers trailer has dropped in. It's gotten people discussing a lot, and something I've heard quite a lot is people expressing their disappointment towards it while other people arguing that they shouldn't criticize an unfinished product. And by guessing by the title of this video, you can probably assume what I think about that statement. Essentially, I'm saying that you should judge an unfinished product. And this is why. First impressions are a very important thing for a lot of reasons. It's the first look you get at anything, really and it's going to be what you form most of your opinions around. In terms of video games, showing off an unfinished build is essentially like showing off a trailer for a movie. It's supposed to get across what it's going to be like, and what you should expect from it, so that if you do find it interesting, or find it enjoyable, the audience will be interested in the progress and development of said game, but if the unfinished product that is being shown is unappealing, it'll give the audience the idea that the finished product will be unappealing. Simple as that. Using Sonic Frontiers as an example, since that's the hot topic right now, it looks rough and just really not good, at least in my opinion. So. This reveal trailer of the gameplay has made me lose interest in it, and while I do want to suspend my disbelief and think that the game will be good, Forces has burned me a bit too hotly. When I saw the mediocre gameplay footage back in 2017, I thought, oh, well it's probably just an older, unfinished build, and then when I got the game, it was in the final game, and it left me feeling very disappointed. So, I do have to come at this with a grain of salt, especially considering the Sonic franchise as a whole. That's not to say, however, that there aren't exceptions to this. Take, for example, Spec Ops The Line, a very well-made game with an amazing story showing the true atrocities that war can have on people, but it was marketed as a really generic Call of Duty clone, so barely anybody actually played it. But as I said before, those are the exceptions. And let me ask you, did anybody look excited for Mighty Number no. 9 after that one reveal trailer dropped? where they said make the bad guys cry like an anime fan on prom night. Or going back to Sonic, how many people actually were excited for the Sonic movie when they had the first horrible design for him? Another thing I want to mention is that criticism does not equal hatred, at least sometimes. Criticism leads to improvement because you can see where you're falling short and then you can know where to improve and where you can do better in certain places. I know when I'm making animations, I usually have some of my other friends who are artists, or not even artists, watch my rough animations and have them critique it to make sure if anything looks off, because sometimes it is a lot better to get a second opinion on these things. Because if you just plug your ears and ignore all criticism, there's no way that you can actually improve in any substantial way. And if things don't improve, people lose interest and stop believing that they actually will improve. Unless you are a Pokemon fan. And if the creators didn't want people to discuss or criticize whatever product they were presenting, they wouldn't have presented an unfinished product to begin with. If people didn't want to discuss or criticize a movie, they wouldn't release a trailer. If they didn't want to criticize a game, they wouldn't show a gameplay demo. Remember, there is such thing as toxic positivity. So what did we learn today? Criticize unfinished products. Criticism does not equal hatred. And that you should subscribe. And the future is awesome. Everyone has a jetpack. And the future is awesome. Everyone